right, well, a healthy start to the new year is a resolution that so many of us want to keep, but doing it we know can be so, so tough. So we invited Jake Shostak from Mod Pizza here to share a, a healthy idea when it comes to one of our favorite foods, pizza. Welcome back. Yeah, nice good to, to be you. here. Thanks All for right, having me. So, you know, a lot of people, we don't think pizza and, and think healthy, but you're saying you can kind of do that? Sure, why not? All yeah. right, so, so tell us, how do we do that? Well, you know, part of uh, having a healthy diet is choices mm -hmm. and portion control. Right. And at MOD, it stands for Made on Demand, M-O-D, and uh, you can also MOD is what you make it. And so you can choose whatever veggies do you want, whatever proteins that you want, mm -hmm. and you can control how much you put on there or what you don't want to put on there. So you can actually turn it to your advantage. Okay, um, all right. So what is your, your healthy version of pizza here? So one of the cool, unique things that we do is we do a pizza salad, which all is right. a good way to bring the best of both worlds. Mm -hmm. uh, this is what I order frequently. So what we do is we just take a regular 11-inch dough, all right. and then we put a little bit of uh, Asiago cheese on it. It doesn't even need to be too much. Okay. And then we put this right into the oven, so it's baking fresh, and it only takes about two minutes to cook. I and while that's that. happening, we're actually going to make a salad that we put on top of it. Nice. So, get, your, get your greens in, too. Exactly. <laughs> absolutely. Okay. That's a good way where you can take the salad. You can roll up in the crust if you wanted to, or you can just use a yeah. fork. But okay. um, So today we're just going to do a classic Caesar salad. Okay. Nothing special to it. Just fresh cut romaine lettuce, mm -hmm. Parmesan cheese, All right. a little bit of Asiago, and diced tomatoes. Our salad actually comes traditionally with croutons as well, but I chose not to do the croutons today because that's a good way to cut some calories out of there my There you diet. go. You right. could do that. And like you said, too, when it comes to the crust, it is, it's so thin, so it doesn't feel like you're getting, you know, like a really bready, thick pizza exactly. if you don't want it. Exactly, yeah. If you don't want it, yeah. It's a thin crust pizza. You know, we like to say that we want to have that nice uh, hybrid between crunch and pull, so it's like a, yeah. not quite like a cracker thin, not like, yeah. you know, it's going to break off yeah. and you're going to pull it a little bit, but it's definitely a thin crust. And we actually use a, uh, a new flour we just brought in, which is 100% uh, all American ingredients mm -hmm. and GMO free. Wonderful. Okay. And you do have gluten free options as well? We do have a gluten free option okay. as well. All right. So you're just uh, mixing that up and then. Just mixing it up. And then right now, like I said, that our dough is in the oven, but <laughs> magic of TV. Here we go. <laughs> and then we just lay this right on top. Nice. So something unique, something different. Yeah. A good way for you to, you know, Get some crust in there if you wanted to, but really pre uh, predominantly keep it a healthier hey, meal. Easy, right? Okay, so you have some other um, seasonal pizzas going on. Just describe them for us real quick. Yeah, this is actually something we're really proud of. This is the Winston, mm -hmm. which is going to be put on our menu for our seasonal option as of tomorrow. And the Winston features roasted cauliflower. Nice. We do Lil Ma hot peppers, which is a boutique hot pepper brand out from the West Coast. And then we also brought in chicken jalapeno sausage for it. Oh. And we got white sauce, mozzarella, a little bit of rosemary. Oh, those flavors sound incredible. All right, mm -hmm. what, over, what about over here? So this one's actually my personal favorite. This is a Tristan. This is a vegetarian pizza, mm -hmm. right? It's going to be a little bit of uh, Asiago cheese. We do roasted red peppers, mushrooms, and then a pesto drizzle on at the end. All right, and over here real fast? This is the uh, Dylan James, mm -hmm. similar to a margarita pizza. Basil, garlic, sliced tomatoes, mozzarella cheese, red oh, sauce. Smell it. And then the Dominic, white sauce, tomatoes, mild sausage, onions, basil. All great pizzas. All right, and since you were here several months ago, you guys have really expanded. Where are your locations yeah, now? Yeah, we sure have. Uh, so we, we now have five locations in uh, the Metro Detroit area. We're in Livonia, Northville, Rochester Hills, we're in Woodhaven, and then we just opened up in Brighton as well. So the response has been great, I take it, huh? It has been really encouraging. Everyone's really excited with the ability to be able to come in, make your own meal. We do different sizes, so if you mm -hmm. wanted to do something lighter for lunch, we got a size that's even half this. Also works well for kids. Wonderful. All right, Jake. Thank you so much for coming back in. And, uh, and we me. like to call this breakfast right now. Yeah, so. right. Nothing like Sunday morning breakfast. <laughs> exactly. Thank <laughs> yeah. you. Thanks very and much. we'll have yep. more information on our website, wxyz.com. Just check the scene on 7 Section.